Hey everybody, it's Carol Billing. I've been working in SimNet today and I've come up with a couple things I wanted to show you. Okay, so here I'm logged in as a student and um, what you want to do from here is go into the first chapter. I'm just going to walk you through how to get your points for the first chapter. So you're going to read all of these things. Um, now I tried, I tried to change it so that you didn't have all three buttons. Okay, I haven't seen them yet. Hang on. You're going to actually read all this stuff. And when it, a how to, we're not going to do those. I just want you to get a, a read it and get an overall idea of how things work in Windows 8 because most of you probably don't have Windows 8. If you do, then you can try stuff and that's awesome and that's what I would do if I had Windows 8. However, I don't. Okay. So on these, you see how I have check marks on them? It's because I've done them already, and you're going to have to do them all. And I know that sounds like, oh my god, but really there's only 11. And um, they each take like two minutes. So I'm thinking an hour, you should be done with this chapter. And um, But you need to do each one and make sure you get the check mark on each one. And I thought I had turned it off so that these two weren't showing, but that's not happening. And when I went through it, I thought it was really useful to actually do the guide me and then let me try just for this first chapter. I am still working on the subsequent chapters. So for right now, I'm just wanting you to get through the first chapter. Okay, so here you can see I've done the show me, but I haven't done the guide me or the let me try. And this is on 1.2. Now right here when you drop this down it shows you what, what you've done in the chapter. So this check mark means that was just a reading part through reading part um, and so here is something I haven't done. So if you click on it it takes you to this part. Now once I go through these two buttons when I go back here that will be checked off. And so you want to go through and make sure everything is checked off all the way down to number 13. Now these don't have checkoffs and we're not doing these. So they have not been assigned. So this, as long as you get down to 13 and you have all your checks here, you're going to have your points for this first chapter. Let me show you another place where you can go to check that out. So if I close the chapter book here, this always scares me because I think it's going to throw me all the way out of SimNet, but it doesn't, which is really not intuitive. Okay, here we are back at the beginning. And um, I don't even know how I got here, but this is also helpful and it gives you the check marks and it says, how did I get here? Let's see, overview chapter one. So there's your box. That takes you to the chapter. Oh darn it. Okay, there you go. All right, I just clicked on the box and got there. It sure seems like last time I did that, I went into the chapter, but there you go to open the book. Okay, fine, enough chit chat. Anyway, this part is helpful to understand. So this means you've read it. That means you actually did the one t by one. It means I did the all three buttons for one task. Okay, in creating and saving, I've got two tasks with three button each. That's how you get your six. Okay, so for this whole chapter, there are 11 things. Seven, six plus one is seven, plus three is 10, plus one more is 11. So these are your 11 tasks for the chapter. But you also need to do all the reading, you know, at least read through the pages, and that's where you get those green checks all the way down to 13. And then these are not assigned, so you don't have to worry about those. Okay, that said, um, let's just take a look real quick here. This is also another way to jump quickly to whatever it is you haven't done. So here's your one, two, and three, and then four, five, and six. And so I've only done one, so it's not giving me those six points. Oh, okay, I'm, I lied. Here we go. There's more. That's two, three. There must be six set of buttons to get the six points. Okay. Oh, I love new software. Okay. Uh, so you have to do all three in order to get the points. And I've only done one of each, so I'm not getting them. Okay, I think we've all got that.
I want to show you your grades. This is another place to check and see if you've gotten your credit for the chapter. So you can go here to grades and it's going to say overview chapter one nine percent because I've only gotten one of the eleven things done and current grade is one out of eleven and then there it gives me right back to the check boxes so these are where your eleven things come from and each one of those things is three buttons and you have to do all three buttons before you get credit okay so I hope that helps and um, when I go into the grade book I'm looking for this to be a hundred percent for this first chapter and it was due tomorrow right and I'm gonna bump it back but I want to see some progress in here so I know that you're getting it because I'm looking to see how, I can see how many times you've logged in and how much time you've spent and um, I want to see that you're at least getting started and getting some work done because my concern is more that you um, are able to use SimNet rather than anything else. Okay, so this deadline is going to change to this deadline. I have to log out of being the student account into my faculty account before I can make that change. But I'm going to do that and I will also reflect that on the calendar. Okay, I think that's it. Thanks.